Hi, I'm Shelly LeVette with ChildCareLand.com. Today I want to share with you an umbrella pom-pom match, an excellent activity for color recognition as well as fine motor development. You just need to have umbrellas, and I made these out of colored cardstock paper, traced around a bowl, a smaller bowl, on um, six different colors of cardstock paper. And then I cut off about a quarter of that circle to kind of make an umbrella shape. You can make them however you want, and they just attach a, a brown... Um, bottom for each one of the umbrellas and then I have pom-poms that will match the six colors of the umbrellas that I have uh, put out here and um, you don't have to but regardless of whether we work on um, a metal tray or not I usually put a magnet on the bottom of our pom-poms so they're kind of weighted down and they don't tend to roll around as much which can become frustrating for young children when they're trying to put more than one on a section and they accidentally bump one it rolls way off and um, so they just um, stay in place better when they have a little bit of weight added to that but that's again that's something that's totally up to you but um, we like that and it seems to work well and so how I have the set that set this up is the pom-poms are in a bowl and then the six colors are set out and if you can find more pom-poms, that's great with different colors on it and just make match, more matching uh, color umbrellas with that. But for now, we're using six. And uh, they start out totally blank, and then children will come and sit down and then pick out the pom-poms and then put them on the same colored umbrella. And they really enjoy these pom-pom activities on there. And again, these are excellent for fine motor skills development on here. And I have uh, pretty much all the same number of pom-poms for this video, but something you may want to do is not put the same number of pom-poms for each umbrella and then have the children count the number when they're all done putting all the pom-poms on. Have the children count the number on each umbrella and then find one that's got the most and one that has the least pom-poms on it. We always try to expand, extend excuse me, our activities um, somehow into a math activity when we do these kinds of, of things on there. But so you can kind of get the general idea of the way it would go and then they can just remove them all and put them back into the bowl. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do so so you can be notified when new videos are released. And also please sign up for my free weekly newsletter at childcareland.com or childcarelandblog.com. And if you like the material I present in these videos, Please like, comment, and share. I truly appreciate your support. For Umbrella Pom Pom Match, I'm Shelly LeVette with childcareland.com. And thanks for watching.